I wanna be the best in the game, invest in my name Check no restraints, I'm obsessed with the pain I ingest, I retain, assess and I change Possessed by the thought I'll be free one day From society's restraints, money, clout and fame Mud disease, a plague, we all love to hate Have to play the game, have to make a name All our insecurities are on This display. is war with the enemy Think that it was meant to be Living in a time where disease is on every screen I won't let them fester me I know most are festering Negativity is a plague for the mentally weak No mercy, all I God is working, never stop searching, never quench the thirsty I'm toxic and psychotic with this logic, you can't stop it It's been chronic since I was a boy, so neurotic and chaotic I'm Go. to last with the webs I'm weaving I could change the past with all I'm achieving Got my foot on gas, never stop competing If you break like glass, then this life's gonna eat em. Make mistakes real fast, then you learn how to beat em. If you take off the cast, you can see all the healing If the pain's in the past, move on from the grave And put your foot on the gas, no, never stop competing, yeah I've been doing this, I'm on it I just wanna be iconic Sipping on a gin Welcome and back to my channel to go forever, Mrs. M Thank you for tuning in If it's your very first time, I really hope you stay If you're an oldie but a goodie, thank you very much for coming back to my channel Guys, I still haven't recovered from that a holiday from that uh, staycation that we had last week today it's actually a Tuesday but I still haven't recovered like I'm so so tired I'm so worn out and like I, I just I just don't know guys I, like we had so much fun like too much fun if you ask me to the point where we just all still haven't recovered I was talking to Vida today she was like no was yesterday she was like I just haven't recovered I've just been sleeping and like that's what I did yesterday I just like my body just gave in because we had too much fun like we were just <laughs> we're just having fun and like so today it's a Tuesday and like I said I still haven't recovered I'm still feeling fatigued but there's a couple of things that I need to do for my house so I need to go to town excuse me there's nothing I can do about that I need to go to town because if I don't get it done I'll never get it done and then um I'm still here to do groceries um Baba Zoe is just um I'm just waiting for him uh, so that we can go do groceries as well. So, yeah, I really hope you guys do enjoy this vlog. Thank you for the love on my last vlog. Thank you for your immense and continuous support. I really, really do appreciate it. And if it's your second, third, fourth time, thank you so much, guys. We're almost at 3K subscribers. Probably by the time this video goes up, we may be over 3K subscribers. But I really, really do appreciate it each and every person who has subscribed even if you subscribe and then you're away for a little bit and then you come back i still do appreciate you so much so yeah um that's that's my day guys i'm just wearing this black dress you guys know this black dress it's a wrap dress and i think the only thing that i need to do is put on jewelry and also get black shoes do i even have black shoes <laughs> i wonder i've been loving the zara perfume guys like it's called the gardenia yeah gardenia zara bloom O2. I've been really really enjoying this and you guys one thing that I learned is that these cheaper perfumes um we need to keep um reapplying them throughout the days that the scent lasts because they're cheaper right they don't last the whole day but yeah I just wanted to quickly do an intro for you guys so that it like you're not confused as to what's happening so yeah guys let's get into the rest of this vlog guys even my voice sounds tired my aura is tired <laughs> but I mean we need to keep vlogging keep working this this is my work now. So I need to keep working, keep vlogging, keep remaining consistent. Because you guys have also been consistent with your views. Like, I've been getting the same amount of views. So we need to work towards getting more and more and more. So yeah, thank you guys so much for your support. And let's get into the rest of the vlog. Hey guys, so it's actually the next day um, from when I did my intro. I ended up not going... Um, Okay, the lighting was a bit bad, yeah. I ended up not going uh, to to World Remit yesterday. I don't know if I told you guys, but I ended up not going because uh, Baba Zoe came from work late. So I, I went today alone. So I'm just going to go and go inside. I don't know why I didn't uh, 
take off the scrunchie i'm going to go ahead and go inside and go and collect the money then i'm going to go and get my third jab uh for my vaccine because i'm i'm outstanding a third jab so i'll go and get my booster so yeah i'm filming from my phone guys so i don't know how it will come out on the video when i trans when i export this footage to my other camera because i didn't i didn't bring my camera but yeah we'll see how it goes so let's go inside guys and uh collect i always collect my money at posb it's so convenient for me every time and the queues like move fast the ones that okay are always quite big so i don't prepare going to okay so yeah let us head inside guys <laughs>
guys so it's actually later on in the evening well it's like around five so i feel it's getting a bit cold and today i just didn't even want to deal with my hair that's why i had the dupe the whole day um so i'm thinking of dyeing my hair so that it blends better with this so in and then i'll just wash it and see and my skin is currently breaking out from the trip that we had but i want to make some cereal i feel like cereal and i'm actually filming from my phone guys so you see that some of the clips from the last vlog uh were from my phone and then i'm just trying to, i'll just have to put you guys here i'm just trying to oops please don't go. i'm just trying to see how vlogging with my phone goes so i'm feeling a bit of cereal guys i thoroughly enjoyed the smoothie that i made myself earlier i thoroughly enjoyed it so i'm just gonna have um some cornflakes uh, i've already cooked dinner guys and i already cooked dinner and today i just made um rice and beef and rice and beef and some coslo and guys i just wanted to have a conversation with you it's getting a bit chilly the weather is funny today so i just wanted to have a conversation with you guys about how i've been showing up for myself um in different ways or different different no actually i want to tell you different ways i've been showing up for myself wait let me retake my camera and use my bad camera Okay, so this should definitely be clear. Let me just get my mop. Two seconds. Yeah, I guess the lighting right now is definitely clear. So yeah, I just want to tell you guys the different ways I've been showing up for myself. Um, I've been showing up for myself by consciously making a decision to be present in everything that I do. So like, if I'm not like if i wake up right when i when, whenever i wake up i try to put myself first um because if i'm not right everybody else can be right i can't make everyone else happy if i'm not right in the morning mentally emotionally physically i can't be a great mom to Zoe. i'll probably just spend the whole day frustrated and i think that's that's where that's the mistake i made when my daughter was younger because i was con co constantly i was constantly um stress constantly on edge constantly frustrated because whenever i woke up every day i would not put myself first i would just try as hard as i could to make sure the laundry was ironed i think you guys saw in my vlogs um before i had to help out make sure that the laundry was done ironed cooking was done and like i was on go 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 to please my husband and zoe and i was forgetting about myself and that's constantly kept me on edge right so i've just told myself that you know so that i don't have a pile of things to do whenever i wake up i'll make my bed clean my bedroom and those little changes that you do every day um you know because like when i was frustrated i'll reach a point where i'm like i'm not even gonna bother to do it because i'm just tired so like because i've started showing up for myself more i barely get frustrated now so you see that whenever i wake up i'll wake up and then i'll you know give zoe well zoe sleeps with auntie now because she sleeps better than she doesn't wake up so generally i've been sleeping better because i don't sleep with my daughter anymore and she doesn't every time she sleeps with auntie she doesn't wake up in the night if she sleeps with me she'll wake up like ten thousand times so like since i stopped sleeping with her i've been sleeping so much better so i will usually take her around 5 a.m and obviously because i've had good rest it's not an issue so until we clean the house and then once she's done she'll take zoe around nine maybe eight no maybe not nine eight seven thirty eight and then she'll feed her her food her breakfast and then i'll take her whilst i'm cleaning my bedroom and then i'll take her to bath and then after bath and we'll, she'll have a breakfast and then they'll go to sleep together so like i have so much time and because i made a conscious decision that i want to show up for myself and feel good internally it's made such a difference in my life guys and i think that if you can always put yourself first i know like people will be like how can you not put your kid before yourself but if but if i do that i won't come out right every other day my child is one of the most important people to me my child and my husband they're so important to me but if i don't put myself right i can't be a good you know partner and i can't be a good mom because i'm constantly frustrated like i said so yeah i've just made a conscious decision to do the things that i really enjoy and incorporate my daughter into doing those things so like 
I love to bath, guys. I love to look good. So I'll just incorporate those things with my daughter, right? So if I'm dressing up, I'll dress up with her. I'll also, you know, make sure I put her in a cute outfit. And I've just made a conscious decision to, you know, I like to match with my daughter. So I'll try and put up a matching outfit with her. We'll talk about it. Like, I'll make a joke. Like, every time auntie's like, okay, what am I dressing Zoe? I'll be like, ah, let's ask the older, you know, that type of thing. So yeah, I incorporate her in the things that I like. And I, I think it's very important for my daughter to grow up well-groomed, looks good, feels good. And if I don't teach her those things or those soft life elements, guys, soft life does not mean traveling every other day. But even the things that you do can show that you're living a soft life. So like just waking up and dressing up. Today I was dressed up, guys. It's just because it's getting a bit cold. I've put on this morning gown, although my hair is not done. But you guys know that most of the times I'll dress up even when I'm at home and I'll incorporate that into my daughter. And this fly, I don't know what's wrong with this fly. And I really try and do the things that I enjoy. So even if my husband can't make it to some of the things that I enjoy, I don't stop. I, I, don't, I don't not do them because he can't make it, right? Because then I'm going to be frustrated because his job is so demanding. So we could plan to do something and then he comes back home. He's super tired. So like, I don't want to, I don't want to not do the things that I enjoy just because the people around me can't not do them. So because I enjoy these things, I'm going to do them. And it so helps with my mental health and my mental stability. And yeah, guys, I think that's basically just like, the main thing that I've been doing to show up for myself is not waiting for other people to be available to do things that I like. So if you see that in your life, you're always constantly waiting for the other people to be available so that you do things that you enjoy, you're going to crumble at some point. If you see something that you like, that's why you see a lot of American YouTubers, they talk about solo dates and things like that, like putting themselves first and not waiting for anyone else because your happiness does not depend on the next person it depends on yourself so go out there do the things that you like show up for yourself put yourself first and spoil yourself guys don't hesitate to go into that shop you're the fly and buy whatever you feel like buy that expensive perfume buy whatever you feel like spoil your loved ones but always come through for yourself and put yourself first so guys that's my little ted talk for today let me go and eat my cereal because it's starting to drown and i'll catch you guys probably tomorrow bye hey guys it's bright and early well not bright and early anymore but it's bright definitely bright um by the way and i left the house to go run a few errands i literally had to force myself to go with him and i literally had to force him to go with me rather so we're just having some ice cream and then I need to go and get that dye that I told you guys about. I don't know if I told you, but I think I did. I need to go and get that dye that I told you guys about. And then I need to go and do my body cam, wash my hair, and, you know, do all that. And then, guys, today I actually managed to go and give my friend some fresh lettuce from my garden. My lettuce is all the way, like, proper. It's fresh. I don't know if I'll be able to take a photo for you. Let me not promise. But, yeah. I went and gave my friends latest. They were so happy. And then, um, babe, what do you think about my garden? It's better than I expected. <laughs> you know, guys, when I started this garden, Mr. M was laughing at me. He was like, ah, what are you doing? And then the garden started thriving. And then we started eating some veggies. So today, I actually got, um, let me show you. Ooh, how will I hold my ice cream? Let me put a bit of cream in it. I actually got some more seeds so I'm gonna do butternut oh this will obviously be the opposite those are going to be my new additions to my garden so I'll catch you guys um, when I catch you next so bye the rest of today I'm gonna be singing Zesa did me dirty because like make it make sense why did Zesa go as soon as I finished washing my hair I, like honestly why did Zesa go honestly honestly and like I'm, I'm i'm experiencing a breakout guys but well, i'm recovering from a breakout from whenever we went to nyanga but yeah i guess this is a sign guys for you guys to wash your weave if you have your weave and you haven't washed it please wash it because you can actually wash your weave you just focus on your scalp so that your scalp feels fresh but yeah once this comes back we'll sort this out because it's a lot and it's a mess but yeah just wanted to update you guys um on this and um i want to get started on oops on thorough cleaning my bedroom as well Although it's like late in the afternoon. I already removed everything. The blankets, the bedding and everything. I just need to 
do it i'm really loving this guys maybe we'll stick to its natural texture now but you never know with me i wish it was longer guys i wish like it was a bit longer maybe like up to here i think i would enjoy it more but yeah guys i just wanted to give you that update i also took a shower after um, after that um after washing my hair i also took a shower ow my hand is sore but yeah uh this uh, i told you guys this i decided to go again but yeah am i gonna keep playing with my hair like this i'm just super loving what's going on with my hair and uh, this vlog i mostly filmed it on the on my phone i'm just trying to see like do i film from my phone and use my camera for photos or can i interchange like when i go to places where i may be uncomfortable to carry my camera or to take out a huge camera i can just use my phone so we're testing that and testing the quality and yeah guys ooh, ooh, ooh. let me go sit outside so my scalp actually dries currently entertaining this guy Whilst he fixes this car. He, what what are you doing to the car? Huh? Fixing the lights. So we okay, the lighting is not in your favor here. Let me just choop. Okay, tell us what are you doing? I'm fixing the lights. Hmm, baby. Can you see this thing, this bonnet? Because it's so bad. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like a blanket is coming off. Yeah, Men at work, can you show them my outfit, please? It's fine, don't worry. Let's show them the outfit. The missus and the outfit. Hey. Almost back. Almost back. Mine's the window, behind you. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to get my head. Should I model? <laughs> okay, thank you, baby. <laughs> so, yeah, guys, I'm entertaining this guy. Whilst he fixes his car, we're talking about a lot of things. Just catching up. And whilst he takes my knives from the kitchen to use them, why are you taking my knives, babe? Where's where where you where's your toolkit? I didn't steal your pies, just for the record. You look handsome, but you need a haircut. <laughs> ah, baby, look ya. Ah, you need. Ah, it doesn't it doesn't count anymore. This guy, I cut his hair once, and then he said he, he told me I shouldn't shape his head because he said I would mess it up, so I didn't shape his head. Then he went to the barber. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> but they still messed you up. <laughs> but then they still messed you up, and then that was the first day, Kade. And then you went again. But you said the second time he got it correct. Yeah, so that's the story of his haircut. Ah, baby, what do you want to say to my vlog? I don't know, what is it about? It's just a vlog. Okay. Everything. I was just showing them, you. No, no, I, I don't know. Okay, what time are you going to be done with this car? Um, like... Ten Today there's no soccer, soccer so this yeah, guy... Yeah. There's no football, there's international football, so... Yeah, this is the time we have to, to do other things. Our chores around the house. Yes. <laughs> oh, these are your chores. Yeah, these are my chores. Yeah. Okay, baby. <laughs> hey guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog because this vlog is all over the place. I'm going to go ahead and end it here. I hope you guys really did enjoy this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit the post notification box so that you're the first one to know when I do upload a new video. And yeah, guys, I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.